Where I did my training was where they did the first hip replacement. It was a six or seven hour surgery. Uh, there was a lot of blood loss. Typically the patient would be in the hospital for seven days. They would not put full weight on the leg and there was a very high rate of dislocation. Things are evolving in orthopedics and things are changing. Every year we try to improve what we're doing and so one of the latest inventions is use robotic surgery. So you have these smart tools uh, that are basically uh, giving feedback constantly through the computer based on the CT scan. And as you're doing each part of the surgery, those smart tools are providing feedback as to the exact amount of bone you're taking out and the exact angle of the positioning of the implants. With the use of robotic surgery and the pre-op CAT scans and interoperative alignment methods that we use, the accuracy of putting in the components today has increased. It makes me a better surgeon. I'm able to put the implant in better than I was able to do prior to the use of the robot. We can see the implant in the knee uh, three-dimensional even before we make our first cut. So we are going to be able to align the knee, look at the tracking of the knee before we do any surgery at all. For patients that are suffering from joint pain and specifically hip and knee pain, we have a lot of options now. As a joint center of excellence, we offer a comprehensive approach to the patient and we do this with the latest technologies to try to accelerate postoperative care.